Jen Vothrin coming to you today from Solutions Counseling. How do we enjoy Christmas when we've gone through traumatic times? So I'm going to tell you a few tips on what's going to help you get through this time when you've been through the worst time in your life or you're experiencing the worst time in your life, such as being on the street right now. You're homeless, you don't know where to go, you don't know whether to connect with your family, and your family's dying to know where you are, or if you're the family and you don't know where your loved one is, uh, whether you've lost your brother, your sister, your mother. I lost my mom December 15th, so I truly do understand what it's like to be going through this, the guilt, the shame, how can I be enjoying this time when they've passed away, the, the reason I celebrated was because of them. Why do I get to celebrate? Why am I celebrating? What's there to celebrate? Well, I'll tell you what there is to celebrate. Is that nobody ever wants you to be miserable. Anybody that's passed away, your dog, your cat, your mom, your dad, your spouse, your son, it's, it's a horrible time. I'm not going to lie, it's the worst time probably ever. And what they would really want for us is for us to survive and be happy and pay it forward. Pay it forward. Go and do something that makes you feel good about yourself. Some It might be traveling for you. For me, it's about feeding people that don't have as much, giving to people who don't have as much. Or And there's been many times when I haven't had those things and still being able to feel good about giving somebody a jacket or seeing the smile on somebody's face when they don't have what we have. This is so very important. Christmas is not about presents. It's truly about paying it forward. Paying it forward people. This is what we need to do. That's all we need to do. Open, open up. Give somebody a hug. Tell somebody they're beautiful. Ask them what you can do for them. How can you serve them? That is what this is about. Those who are living on the streets, you have a gift. You have nothing to feel ashamed of. The key thing here is that your experiences are going to help so many other people. Like, I mean so many other people. I have an incredible girlfriend who lived on the streets for five years and didn't know whether she was going to wake up to somebody being dead next to her. And I won't get into her story because it's her personal story. And I respect and love her. And I, I respect and love her more now than I ever have many people in my life because of what she's gone through. And she is just an incredible gal who survived it. And knowing that she can survive it, you can too. And what she's doing with her life now would blow your mind. I really feel as though you have so much to give. Please pay it forward with us. Please pay it forward to people who feel as though gifts are the most important thing. When gifts aren't the most important thing, love is the most important thing sharing our experiences. God bless all of you. Love you. Have a very, very Merry Christmas. Pay it forward and enjoy. Hey, Jeff Bothran here coming to you from Solutions Counseling. Drugs. All right, let's get to the bottom line. Okay, how many of you out there do drugs? 